It's the Logan Power Show Inspirational and motivational It's the Logan Power Show Informational to help you grow Logan, Logan, Logan Logan Power Show And now the host Calvin Logan. Hey everybody, hey everybody, welcome to the Logan Power Show. It's me, your host, Calvin Logan, and I want you all to tune in, turn it up, turn your volume up, get connected with us. Hey, understand fitness is a part of life. You got to be whole, you got to be healthy, and you got to get your life together. Well, I got with me a man who has the the antidote, the ingredient to keep your health together. He is the owner of one of the best places where you'll get your life together we uh, in full circle fitness the one and only mr sean stewart what's going on sir hey hey that that was an introduction <laughs> right there my brother <laughs> thank hey. you thank you things is, things are good things are good absolutely absolutely well we know health is is something that we really have to um uh use as part of our lifestyle yeah. definitely with COVID 19 um you know immune system has to be built so tell us how did this come apart, you know, starting this particular enterprise? And uh, why do we need to hook up with you now in this, in this time of our lives? Uh, hey, it's a, it's a pleasure. Um, thank you for having me. Thank you for taking, uh, taking the time out. Um, but uh, to jump right into it, it, it was, it's, a, it's a goal of mine to, to, to be in the best shape I could possibly be uh, for my family. Um, I served 20 years in the military and uh, through that, I, I, I've learned that if nothing else, to make sure you take care of yourself, take care of your body. Uh, and fitness was one of the things that not only helped me keep myself um, physically strong, but also mentally strong. And a lot of people don't associate the two, um, that especially with COVID-19, that your health is a lot mental, uh, uh, is just as important mentally as it is physically. And physical health helps with mental health. Um, having that outlet, having that, that capability of putting that energy towards something positive uh, to help you through a, a tough time, a tough moment, um, a tough year, year and a half with, with, with COVID. Um, but these are the tools that you get from working out, uh, the, the, the chemical change that your body goes through when working out is something that is extremely uh, beneficial to your health, mentally, emotionally, uh, physically, and, and also spiritually. Uh, Cause uh, I mean, when on your way to burpee 100, I'm, I'm sure, I'm sure God, God helps you get there some way, somehow. And so, so it's definitely a spiritual, a spiritual mo movement as well. <laughs> absolutely. Absolutely. Well, definitely can. Um, thank you for serving our country. And it's a blessing for people like yourself to do so 20 years, uh, two decades, putting in the work uh so what what's the experience like i know a lot of times when we talk about the experience piece like you can have all the right equipment um everything in place but the experience i think is one thing that we don't we don't really focus on and you mentioned about the health the mental side because you can say like hey we open from 24 7 fitness but if i'm not mentally focused to step into the gym to put in the work um to get my life right uh, what what should we experience if we say, hey, we're going to sign up with you? Yeah. Uh, one, I can't do my job unless you do your job. And um, before you come into any fitness journey, uh, just like you before you start any journey, you have to have a goal. Um, and you personally knowing your goal uh, makes my job manageable and, and doable. Uh, for you to know where you want to go and what you want to do and make it realistic. Uh, and sometimes that, that, that's part of my job, too, to make it realistic. Um, you, you being me being 42 years old and, and then wanting to be what I was at 23, that ain't realistic. <laughs> so, so we have to talk about what's realistic and, and what's capable and what's manageable. Um, so once we set a realistic goal, it's now time for us to put things in place, uh, establish a schedule. First and foremost, establish a schedule that this is going to be a priority in your life. If it's not, um, then I'm going to see you on Monday and then I won't see you a, a, another Monday again. 
uh, and it's, it's anything, anything. Fitness is just like anything. You have to make the commitment to it. Uh, we didn't get out of shape in, in one day, so we ain't going to get in, in shape in one day. One meal ain't make us big. Two good meals ain't going to make us small. Uh, anything we've done in life, anything that we were able to be successful at uh, comes from commitment, uh, comes from discipline, uh, and it comes from, from riding it out. Uh, staying with it when, when you're tired, staying with it when you don't want to do it no more. Um, staying with it when you think, hey, I, I, I'm good now. Uh, and, and fitness isn't just about getting to a point, but maintaining once we get to that point. Uh, so if you had to say there was a, a thing to have before you show up to Full Circle Fitness, or before you show up to any fitness journey, it's to have a goal, uh, a goal for yourself, uh, and, and with that goal, then we can move in the direction of, of getting every individual to, the, to that place. Absolutely. And I think that's something we have to understand. Discipline is something that you have to um, get embedded into your body, embedded into your back, say embedded into your spirit first before the body can re- sort of respond. Because the mind is, is, is a very <laughs> weighted situation where if it's not – if it's not uh, direct in the right place, it can it can definitely falter, and uh, you could collapse. Um, you see it all the time. You know, people are, you know, that are fighting and going through a lot of different things. Uh, so where are you located at? You know, people want to figure out like, hey, where are located? How can I find yeah. the guy? The guy with the twenty years behind his belt. Where can they find you? Uh, I'm at one zero one five zero Dorchester Road, uh, Suite two two two. Um, right next to, to, to Big Lots and, and Dollar General. And more entertainingly, I'm also in the same parking lot as Swig and Swine. <laughs> so <laughs> so uh, <laughs> once you get past that good smell and stuff, you can come, out, come in here and get that real smoke. <laughs> but um, yes, uh, the, the intersection of Dorchester and Trolley here in Somerville uh, is, is where I'm located, which is Great for for people who are transitioning because we're right on two of the main uh, two of the main roads that travel, uh, Dorchester and Trolley. Absolutely, yes, definitely. You gotta, you know, I I think I for me I just had me a cheeseburger and I uh, I had a bite and I couldn't eat no more. Like, because you know burgers take a a long time to process. And I told my yes, I yes, told, I told nutrition, my, <laughs> nutrition. I told my I told my step. I'm like. Ah, can't eat it. I had a little bite, like, nah, that's that's it. I'm throw this away, you know. You know, just I just that's just me. Um, I know I got a lot of work to do. Uh, so what is it that with like when people come to you, is it like a call, consultation they come to you about before you can say you're making this commitment? Cause it sounds like you know, when you come into full circle fitness, it's a commitment situation. It's like you, you, before we start doing anything else, you got to be committed before you come into the gym. I'm, I'm so glad you said that, uh, and, and that's absolutely the truth. Um, fitness is a, is, a, is a money industry that has went away from actually doing what it was set out to do, which is help people get fit. You know, it, it, it's a billion-dollar industry, and that billion dollars is, is honestly made up of people not going to the gym. Uh, people, how many people have of your listeners uh, have a, a Planet Fitness membership that they haven't used in months, years, weeks? Um, however, because it's at the low end of, of $10, they're like, you know what, sooner or later, I'm going to go. Um, and that's basically the fitness industry right now. Uh, people are, are, are giving away their money uh, uh, because they're not investing in themselves. I'm coming to Full Circle Fitness. It's a full conversation that we're going to have about why is this, why is now your, your now? And are you ready for what's going to come with it? And still in that process, people, uh, people feel like they're ready. And at that moment, and at that moment we're having a conversation, they probably are ready. Um, but uh, that the best I can do as, as a trainer is to inquire to make sure that people are ready for the commitment and that they uh, set a goal to, to, to achieve, I help fine-tune that goal. I, I help make that blueprint for that goal. But you still have to be the one who executes it. Uh, and the only way that can happen is through commitment. Um, life happens. So there's going to be some, 
some some hard days at work that's just going to take your drive and your motivation and things away from you that, that, that give you the energy to come in here. Uh, you're going to get sick. You're, that's going to be, you got a wedding to go to. You, you got to celebrate your own wedding or wedding anniversary or birthday, whatever the case is, it may be. These things are not things that stop you from working out. These are workarounds that are part of life that you, you're still going to be able to do even though you're working out. People are under the belief that, hey, my birthday's next week. I can't sign up for a gym membership. Your birthday is one day. <laughs> I don't get this, but your birthday is one day. Uh, and, and too often, we, we, we let one, one uh, uh, missed beat uh, or, or, or missed little discipline ruin a whole process of something. Uh, like like a, there's an old, old, old saying, they say, if you, have a, if you have one flat tire, you don't walk around and flatten the other three because you got one. So, and, and this is the, it's the same concept. Uh, we have to start thinking of things long term, um, not just right now, not just next week, um, not even just for the year. Um, but if you have kids, you have a business, you, you, you have a job, you have people that are relying on you, you yourself want to enjoy your quality of life uh, past just this moment, then it's an investment that is long term uh, and sustainable. Every, every day doesn't have to be a, a, a drag out workout where, um, I'm, where, where you're praying that, that God just come get you just so that you ain't got to do no more. Every workout isn't meant to be like that. And that's my job to make sure that there's a good balance uh, and making sure that the workouts you get is commensurate to not only your capability, but also to your goals. Absolutely. And I want people who are listening to me right now is that uh, I look at working out as like building your faith. Um, I know I'm not where I need to be at. Um, I'm still working out, doing what I got to do. Uh, my goal is like 30, 40 pounds, lose. Um, definitely want to get back to that military weight, but uh, that's going to be a little bit, little bit of a challenge. Yes. Um, but I'm willing to take that ride. Um, I got a good quality partner with me. My wife, she's a, we've been working out for, let's see now, what was it almost nine months straight almost mm. on 10 so, oh no no like i said it, it's like i said she's my hero um you know i thank god has how much weight she's lost i, lo I lost some pounds myself um uh, just looking at the pictures and photos so i just want to encourage people that you know hey um i want to stay the guy looking behind the screen i want to see this <laughs> i want to stay the yeah. same way uh like you know i i don't laugh i don't joke um i believe that health is essential uh, to your life, uh, something you don't want to play with, because um, understand this, um, there are certain things that, you know, I'm all cardio, you know, I still got to get myself together, but there's always techniques that you always try to figure out, like what will work, um, and uh, so I always, uh, it's always good to bring somebody here who's the expert um, in right. some things, because, uh, you know, uh, we always, you know, iron can always sharpen iron, but I always yeah, know that there is, there's someone from there. But final thought, um, there's someone watching and you have this person that's saying, hey, I'm on the couch and I take a look in the mirror and <laughs> don't like what I see. Yeah. And they need the help to get up out the couch. So, Mr. Stewart, the floor is yours to get him out the couch and at okay. full circle fitness. The floor is yours. <laughs> Listen, <laughs> you rubbing on your belly. <laughs> get up. <laughs> Come down to 101, 50 Dorchester Road, Suite 222. Come here, meet your boy, Sean Stewart, Full Circle Fitness. I'll take care of you. Um, fitness is, is a lot more than just moving weights, lifting things. Um, it's an emotional thing. It's a mental thing. Uh, and it's completely, completely necessary uh, for you to be able to enjoy uh, your life to the utmost. We are now in, in the days of where we're not talking about just living our lives, but living our lives with a purpose and with a certain quality um, to make sure that we, we, we can enjoy our lives, we can enjoy our kids, we can enjoy our, our grandkids uh, for as long as possible. And the way we can do that is working together um, and Full Circle Fitness will provide that platform for you um, where you can get to that, that level that you desire. 
Amen. And that's what you want to do. We want to desire. I want you all listening right now. To know that this is not how you start; it's how you finish. Yes. Um, understand this: pivotal times in your lives. We know you're in your early childhood, teenage years. Those are moving mountain moments. When you get in your twenties, you're still in the moving mountain moments. In your thirties, same way. In your forties, those are those are breaking points. Because from your in your forties, from your forty to fifty. Um, in that 10 year time span can either catapult or launch what you're trying to do 50s and 60s you're still in that still moving mountain moments because you still got that fiber that you got to keep going and then once you get into those 70s and 80s and 90s that's when those are life changing pivotal moments you'd be amazed on how um one cheeseburger can can catapult your life if you can't fight it off Yes. through constantly working out it could be like your lifestyle um it, it exercise is just one part of it eating right is one thing i mean you can there's days you can you can like i said ladies and gentlemen you can pig out uh, trust me i i may have a little you no know, fun times i may after this broadcast give myself some ice cream later on tonight but i do it in moderation i can't say i have ice cream every day i can't say I have a cheeseburger every day french fries every day it's not gonna always work um, yes, I do work out. Yes, my man here, he's, as you say, Mr. Stewart, he's he's 42. And like I said, you know, definitely he's 42, but he's 42 looking like he's 32 because he's, take, <laughs> he's, he's taking care of himself. And, you know, people like us, we're taking care of ourselves. Um, we don't look like the age we should be. Now, for those that are listening, no, I'm not 50. Um, but I am 40. Uh, but hey, God has been good. I just I just watch people over time how they've done things, and I can testify to people. Um, my grandmother's 95, she'd be 95 going to 96. My aunt is what? great, great what? aunt be 95, be 95 this year. So I'm just I'm letting you guys know that there are certain people that are living a life that it may not be like you say on the big screen but they did something something in their life that kept them going that they don't have to say i'm in the hospital bed every day or i i I can't move forward these are the things that we have to understand how important is your life and how it's going to live so family i want you to take this time to say hey if full circle fitness is for you do it get connected but remember keep in mind Mr. Stewart's gonna hold you accountable, just yeah. like if you got Planet Fitness, Absolutely. all these, uh, this Planet Fitness, all other places. Understand, ten dollars I look as an investment. If you want to throw the ten dollars away, hey, go to our website today, www.theloganpowershow.us. <laughs> we'll receive your ten dollars each month, and I will personally thank you personally, saying, you know what, you know what, the ten dollars you give us keeps us moving forward. The Logan Power Show, we don't take a, a, a small donation large and say, oh, one's larger than the other. It, it's all about seeds that you're sown. And I look like this. Exercising is like you're a farmer. So what you're harvesting, whatever seed that you're sowing, you say, hey, I'm going to be great. And being great is a process. So all I ask people today, the seed that you sow today, whatever it is, make a decision and let's move it forward. You never know where the next person could be. This could be the next Mr. Billy Blanks. You're looking to the right, Mr. Stewart. Remember Mr. Billy Blanks, same situation. He was an actor, but he took this whole thing and took a whole other level when it came to working out. And he, it became a phenomenon. <laughs> it became a martial art workout. You know, you think about people that Chuck Norris is, you think about all the people that have been in the game and they're still there. And it's different phases. And you think about these people, you say, well, how am my body looking like that? Well, it's a process. And it doesn't happen overnight. And so I want you all. Process let's, as well as the commitment, like you, like you were saying earlier. Process as well as commitment. And I want y'all to stay committed. I want you to keep it locked and love life. It's all the time I got. My name is Calvin Logan Power Show, nationwide, worldwide. With the one and only nationwide world of Mr. Sean Stewart from Full Circle Fitness. Hey, we love y'all. We'll see you soon. Thank you. Yes, sir.
Order your copy today at www.genevastruth.com. It's the Logan Power Show. Inspirational and motivational. It's the Logan Power Show. Informational to help you grow. Logan, Logan, Logan. Logan Power Show.